you can see that uh, I kind of refined this radius a little bit and I kind of brought it up into more of a taper so it'll follow that line all the way up. Uh, how I did this was mainly I just used the air planishing hammer, a hammer and dolly, and a mallet, and I just kind of migrated up that radius and then blended everything back out on this flange. It wasn't a, it wasn't a whole lot of work. Um, just took a little time to refine and make sure everything still fit right and just kind of cleaned everything up. I went over and planished the top of this a little more while I was at it. And at this point, it's a pretty close piece. And now I can move on. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and measure everything out for the next long section here to bring that up over and back flat. So that'll be the next piece I work on. So I've taken some preliminary measurements off of the car and kind of laid out where that next piece that runs up the fender is gonna go and kind of how to lay it out. So. You know, I've got all my shrink marks laid out. The top is low crown. Uh, I checked it with a sweep. And then this spot here is just extra material in case I need to move anything around. So I'll do kind of a close up view of the sheet metal and my shrinking marks and that kind of stuff. And then I'll move over to the MH19 power hammer and we'll start performing our shrinking. <laughs> Initial shrinks in the panel here. I'll kind of hold that up so you can see it. And our panel is shaped this way, way more than we need. But by the time we blend this out where we shrank, and then I roll the form this way, it'll allow that to flatten out just a little bit. So if anything, it's a little over shrank, which is all right, because that'll let me blend and hammer this out to get rid of any tooling marks. And I can really creep up on it, just like I did the other piece. Uh, in the previous videos. So, you know, we're gonna go from here back to the power hammer and start blending this stuff out. And then we'll use the wheeling machine with a rubber upper wheel to kind of tighten up the form on this. 